Hey everyone, Blazeform227 here, and today I'm bringing you guys a quick tutorial on how to calculate Y values in your KMP using Weemans SLS tools. Now, before you start, make sure you have Weemans SLS tools installed, a KMP file that has everything functioning except for uh, the Y values, obviously, and a KCL file in the same directory as your uh, KMP file. If you don't know how to make a KMP file, Click the card on screen that will bring you to Sneaky's tutorial on how to make KMP. And if you don't know how to make a KCL file, click the other card that will bring you guys to Kevin's quick tutorial on how to create a KCL file. So yeah, what you want to do is open up your folder, open up command prompt, set the directory to wherever your folder is. Then what you want to do is WKMPT decode your KMP file and since I've been doing this before I've already got a course text so uh, let me just re-decode it Oop. so now what you want to do is go down to um, the cannon target positions and last checkpoint. Uh, there you go. Set the case your full width to 200 and the case your full pre add to any number that's going to be above your highest point. So I like to do 10,000. And then you want to do that for each one. So yeah, I'll see, I'll speed this part up then. And now you don't have to do end battle positions because we're not doing the battle course. And so what you then want to do is uh, WKMPT encode your whatever your KMP file is called, .txt and then you want to do is dash O to overwrite it and when you open your KMP file it will have the Y values all set and such here and then you want to close it and then what you want to do is then put your KMP file into your SNS file and yeah when you load up the game it will have uh, had you will spawn in in the correct uh, place and you won't die when you spawn. So yeah, thanks for watching.